So, um, if you want to play games with your friends, like Mario Party, Super Mario Bros. Wii, Super Mario Galaxy, it's super easy, but there's not very any, very many good tutorials, so I'm just going to tell you how. Basically, the first step that's really important, go to controllers. However many people you have, you want to have that many controllers. So, it's just me and uh, my friend. So, we just have two controllers. If you had four people joining, you would have all four controllers set up, okay? Go to configure, and then change these however you want. So, I just use default controls, but you can use uh, any controls you want by changing them up here. Then for your friend, you can also change theirs up, and these are their controls, not yours. So, if whatever they have set up on their dolphin, it doesn't matter. They're just going to be using whatever set up here. But once you have both the controllers set up, then you go over to tools right here. Start netplay. Okay. So you're going to have two tabs, host and connect. And then two connection types, which is direct and transversal or traversal. Then click traversal server go to host set up a name and password so I'm going to do test and password hello then click the game that you want to play so I want to play Mario Party 8 make sure they have the same exact game downloaded from the same exact file then once you have the same fit game downloaded the same dolphin downloaded you can join in like this on the traversal server click host then this is what your screen will look like. You'll see room ID, um, everything like that. Okay, so you just go up here to tools and you go to browse netplay sessions. And it should be with a name is right here, test. Double click on it. And here's the password right here is hello. Okay, and then it takes you to the screen right here. And, and so now, connected to netplay. now we're together in the thing. Now, this part's really important. If you start right here, then uh, nothing will work. So you go to co assign controller ports. And then down here, it says none and none. What I want you to do is change Wii Remote 1 to whoever's player 1 and Wii Remote 2 to whoever's player 2. So then that assigns controllers to them. Say OK. And then now we're both set up. So now I can start up the game. The game starts on both of our screens up here and then we're basically just in the game and then you can just play together so yeah that's kind of it